Yo, what's up with it, everybody? It's your boy, your old boy, Trady, the one with the beard and the kicks. And yes, the Hemi. I know this is a sneaker channel, basically, but it does not always have to be about the sneakers. But since we are talking about sneakers, let me show y'all actually what I got on feet really quick. Bam, yep. Just some old dust, man. Some old dusties, bro. These are the yin yang ones, the black pair, but I tried to do a custom on them and do red. But anyway, man, that's that's not why y'all are here. Y'all are here because I am actually doing a custom, another custom basically, with this plastic dip on my exhaust tips. Right now, as y'all can see, these tips are trash, but they are chrome. And I don't know what happened, but I think I left uh, like some trash in the back of the truck and it started leaking basically. But what I wanted to do is I actually wanted to get white tips and I figured, you know what? I have this right here that I actually used on a couple of parts on the truck already. Like right here, I ain't gonna get too close so y'all can see the imperfections. But And then right here, I did that as well. Um, and I also did some up in the front, but I had some of this plastic dip left. I was looking online. Oh, boop. Almost tripped over my back. Anyway, man, I was looking online and I saw some white tips for the truck uh, that were like $36 on eBay. And so I was like, you know what? Let me use this first. And if I mess it up, then I'll go and buy the tips off of eBay. So we're gonna go ahead and get into this, man. Let me go ahead and get these joints off. I already got my trusty right here. So it's just one bolt. Ah, great thing about having a lifted truck. Let's go. <laughs> Woo, there's one. Look at that, man. It's just like full of gut man i should have put some gloves on bro but it is what it is let's go oh second one this one's trash too bro got both of them off this is what they look like i'm gonna actually try to uh clean these joints off real quick with probably some of this right here um i also got some also have also have this and so we're gonna see try a little soap and water as well but before i actually get into the cleaning man i actually want to see what this thing sounds like without these tips so we're gonna see it might not even sound like anything different man but i know y'all want to hear a cold start so let's get it cool so no difference right there man but let's go ahead and get these joints cleaned up man and then we're gonna start this process let's go all right y'all so i clean these joints off and man that was probably the hardest part if you look at these right here this is the best i could get them and it's not that great bro but i'm hoping that the paint will cover it now you don't have to do any sandpaper or anything like that because this uh, plastic dip will actually adhere to that chrome. I taped it off as well right there so I don't have to worry about that. So we're about to go ahead and start painting man. We're going to do a light coat first just so it can kind of adhere and then we'll probably do about five or six coats because I got plenty of this stuff bro. So let's get it.
All right, got the first coat down, so we're gonna let that sit and dry for about 30 minutes, and then we are gonna come back and just keep doing it over and over again, man. So I'm not gonna bore y'all with all of these five coats. I'll just show y'all the end product. So let's get it. All right, man, so I am done now, and y'all have to excuse the garage, man, but I am done, and this is what the actual finished product looks like. I actually did probably about six coats. I actually just emptied the can on these joints, man, but this is what they look like right here. Let me pick this up. <sighs> right here. So the bottoms didn't come out that great, but this is basically all that's gonna actually show. So not too bad. Uh, let me get a better spot. Yeah, there you go. So you see how the bottoms didn't really come out that great. Um, and I could probably go get me another can, but I don't think it's that serious. The tips actually look pretty good right there. So I'm gonna go ahead and go in, put these joints back on and see what it actually looks like. I guess I really didn't need this tape either. So, but <sighs> you live and you learn, man. Like I said, man, we were just experimenting with this, man. So if these don't look good, I'll just buy the regular tips and you know, we'll get it going there. But look. The truck looks weird without any tips on there, man. It's crazy. Line this up. One down. All right, man, so we are done now, and it looks pretty good, I can't lie, but at the same time, if it wears off like in a month or so or whatever, man, and it does not hold up, I will just go ahead and get the tips. As y'all can see, I, I emptied this. I emptied this out, and here is the finished product, and it looks really good. I know y'all are gonna say I need to delete this chrome as well, but I'm gonna leave it here for right now, man, but this is the finished product right here. As y'all can see, these tips look good, man. With the white tailgate and the white out up here, white out right here. And then you got the hook right there that is white as well. White, white white we're doing good man y'all let me know what y'all think about these in the comment section down below but i think it looks really good right here as y'all can see and i did it still looks yeah a little iffy but all in all i think the white turned out pretty good here is the other side right here I'll let y'all know in like a month or so how it actually goes. Um, hopefully it doesn't like burn off or anything like that. Shouts out to Boosted Motorsports because I saw this on his video. He did black, but I needed to do white. As far as I know, the 5.7 Hemi, like just the gasoline, it doesn't burn so hot, but the diesel will. And so if you do have a diesel, I don't know if this is gonna work on yours, but I will let y'all know in about a month or so how this actually looks. Y'all let me know in the comment section how this looks in your opinion your boy is about to get out of here man hit that subscribe button if you are not already subscribed hit that thumbs up if you like what you see leave comments in the comment section you know your boy is always in the comment section so with all of that being said i'm gonna see y'all when i see you Holla.